Okay, uh, we have one more speaker, Bob Harlow. Here's Bob. So you know the interesting thing about our political system is uh, that you can learn 90% of how it works just by knowing that there are two parties, one of them called Democrats and the other called Republicans. And uh, you know, democracy is where the people of a society uh, have the say, have the power over their government, and a republic is where you have, uh, you know, a select few have that power, and, and the majority of people not have that direct power over their government. And uh, you know, that's really how um, that, that, that's the difference. I was in Richland Center, and I was at the Richland County Fair, and. Um, I uh, just went up and, uh, to this group of people who were talking, and they turned out to be Republicans. And so I was just there all alone, lots of Republicans. And uh, you know, there are two kinds of Republicans. There are the polite Republicans, and there are the rude Republicans. And these were the rude Republicans. Uh, you know, the kind uh, I know who voted for Trump, and not only that, but they liked it. So that, that kind of Republican. And um, it, was, it was weird. Uh, you know, they wanted to ask me about flag burning, and that was like the, the single point of interest that they had. And one of them had a camera up like this, right? And uh, there was another guy, I had a sign up sheet for our campaign just like this one. There was another guy who below the camera frame is has a lighter out and is lit, and he's like bringing it near the sign up form. And uh, so it was, it was strange. Um, by the way, I'm going to take that as an opportunity to pass around the sign up form so that if you'd like to receive emails from our campaign. Uh, you can do that. But to get to the point of the story, uh, one of the uh, people there asked me, what kind of government do we have? And I said, we have a democracy. And, they, and she said, you know, no, we don't, no, we don't. She said, you know, we have, she said, a constitutional republic. And so there is exactly the difference of view that the Democratic Party wants to have a government that's accountable to the people of our country, and the Republican Party wants to have a government that is constitutionally accountable only to a select few. And uh, what it all comes down to is how many people have the right to vote and how many people are voting. Uh, to form good public policy, it, it doesn't take uh, that many scruples, honestly. Uh, but uh, time and time again, when you see a society uh, where you have high voter turnout, where politicians are accountable to the will of their people, you see good public policy, you see prosperity, good education, good health care, and where you see societies uh, where you see low voter turnout or effectively a, a low number of people who are controlling uh, who is in office, you see policies that enrich a handful of key supporters. And um, that's what we've started to see in Wisconsin is we've seen the Republican Party in a concerted effort try to get voter turnout down so that they can sustain policies that enrich just a handful. And uh, the fundamental thing we need to do if we want to change uh, the way that our country works, and you know this because you're here, I mean this is a, a grassroots festival, is we need to organize people and get them to the polls. And just by doing that, just by having people sit at the table who are honestly there to get good results for the people they represent, uh, instead of uh, to line somebody's pockets, our government will start working well for the people of Wisconsin. Um, I hope to get to talk to everyone else more too and talk more about our, our campaign and uh, give you some background on me as a candidate, but I know that uh, we're heading towards the, the celebratory part of the evening, so I'm gonna hand the mic back to Nate, and thank you very much. Thank you, Mark.